Real TV. It's been a while, been a while. Been away from making videos, been busy. Right now I'm diagnosing a slight overheating issue. It's not really major. I got a couple of ideas on what I think it might be. Hint, hint. Um, but as of right now, I'm just kind of testing things. Down here, of course, got a little thermometer. And basically, I'm using this infrared thermometer. And basically, I'm just hitting the hoses. I'm getting as close as possible so I can get a good reading. I'm showing 148.5. I come over here. Let me know that we have a heat exchange that's working properly going through the radiator. Let me get back here and just shoot it. Look closer to the engine. Of course, it's going to be hotter. Let me see. I just want to kind of get an idea of how hot things are on the engine as well. All right, yeah, so we can see why that's getting hot because that housing is 173. Now I'm checking, the, these are your heater hoses here. So let's see what that is. We got 108, got that inlet. Well, I don't know if that's the inlet or outlet. I can tell after I hit this one. I just shot that one, it's 110. Make it closer. Six at the firewall there, same spot. 107. So you got inlet outlet. Yeah. Hit in a couple other places here. Alright. Got a 111 right here. Then of course your exhaust is here, everything so you naturally 112. This one right here, 120. So, 120, 112. So, I'm guessing that would be the inlet that's your outlet because it's going in the exchanger. Alright, so coolant is flowing properly. Let me just check a couple of these lines here just to make sure. Alright, on to plan B. I'm going to have they start the vehicle. And we're gonna see if these fans are operational, making sure I got coolant flowing after I get that cap open. I wanna see the color of the coolant. I wanna make sure there's no corrosion in it. These cars did have a TSB, I remember reading up on it, uh, where the coolant would basically, uh, you know, the corrosion from inside the lines and everything would mix in with the coolant and cause, you know, issues with flowing. But Hopefully this is not the issue. We're gonna definitely take a peek. So, just um, it might be a part two. It might not. But I'll definitely give you guys an update on what's going on and more information on what was the issue and what was the fix. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching.